modern material scientists are actively trying to replicate this. Roman concrete was particularly revolutionary for underwater construction. Building harbors and breakwater meant working with seawater, which is brutal on most building materials. Roman concrete actually performs better in seawater. The port of Caesarea, built by Herod the Great between 22 and 15 BC, demonstrates this perfectly. The environmental footprint of constantly rebuilding infrastructure is enormous. Modern Portland cement production is responsible for about 8% of global carbon dioxide emission. Roman concrete, made with lime and pozzolana, required lower temperatures and produced less carbon dioxide. Roman-style concrete starts to look very attractive. The techniques for working with Roman concrete were sophisticated. For underwater construction at Caesarea, they didn't just dump wet concrete into the sea. They used wooden forms, packed dry lime and pozzolana into them, and sank the forms into position. The sheer volume of concrete the Romans produced is mind-boggling. Modern researchers testing Roman concrete have been consistently impressed by its uniformity. That's not just good engineering. That's institutional knowledge.